I'm sorry, Chat Noir. This may not be the best option. But right now, for yours and Paris's sake, I have to put your safety above mine. Milady, stop it! You... you don't understand! Here, you one Hawk Moth. Take them! And now, let him go! Please, I beg you! Enough! Stop crying! I am trying to concentrate. You kids have no idea what this is all about. Or did you really thought I would let you go like that? I... I am sorry! Arr! Sorry, Kitty. I wish there was more I could do. But right now, I feel so powerless and angry about myself. I am no use anymore. I said enough! How did we end up here? What? No, that's not real. It can't be! M Marinette? Marinette! Why? Why haven't I seen at the moment our eyes first met? All these years, you've been by my side. You've brought me good luck, saved me countless times, and made me smile every day. And now, I wasn't able to protect you. Hawk Moth! <laughs> I don't care if you want to fight me, or Ladybug, or Paris. Not even if you fight against the whole fucking world. But... I won't let you hurt my princess ever again! I am sorry, my princess, but from now on and forever, I will take care of you. For that, my princess, I have to kill him. I won't forgive you. The world will be a better place without you. You deserve to die! I know it. So why? What am I waiting for? Why do I tremble? I can end it. Here, and now! Nobody would ever hurt by him again! Nothing to be scared of! No more Akumas! No more pain! But... What? Hey, Kitty! What's up? Are you listening to me? Hmm? Are you alright, Chat Noir? You're acting kind of strange today. Milady, have you ever thought about the reason we got our powers? Mine is the power of destruction. So, I kept thinking, what if someday... I have to kill a human. Oh. <gasps> you... You're talking about Hawk Moth, right? Then don't worry. He might seem dangerous and constantly evil, but everybody has someone he wants to protect. He's a good guy, and I'm sure we can save him. Even if you say so, accidents can always happen. And what if we are wrong? What do we do if he can't be saved? So no matter what happens in the future, if there's no other way, I should be the one who ki- Don't say it! And don't do it! Listen! If you ask me what I think, why do we got our powers? I would say, because of everyone! Not because we have to bring bad criminals to justice, but to save all the good people out there. She was right, even. If I could end it now, before anything else, I have to save the good ones. Chat Noir? What happened? Where am I? Why is my whole body aching? <sighs> the last thing I remember is that fight between Chat Noir and Hawk Moth. I really hope he is alright. Why do I want to see him that badly? All I can think about is... Huh? Is that... Adrian? M Marinette! Why is Adrian here? Where is Chat Noir? How did I get here? And why am I so tired? This day was so exhausting. Everybody came to wish for a speedy recovery. Only Adrian didn't say a word. On the news they were talking about wounded civilians and property damage. I wasn't able to fix everything. I couldn't protect them. So why... Why is all I can think about is his face? Good evening, milady. Chat Noir! Thank goodness, you're alright! Huh? You shouldn't worry about me, especially since it was my fault. I'll never stop worrying about the people I care about. Listen, you're a hero. Even if you won't admit it to yourself, you saved my life! So don't say anything bad about my awesome partner. I am sorry for everything. Stupid kitty, you have nothing to be sorry about. I'm the one who failed all along. Now you are saying dumb things. But I'm a failure of a ladybug. 
I couldn't even protect Tiki. Actually, I took the earrings from Hawkmaw, but I was uncertain if I should give them back to you. Please don't be mad. I just thought it might be dangerous since he knows your identity. Then you should probably get the miraculous box as well. But it requires you to sneak into my room. Chat Noir? What is that face? Well, to be honest... Don't tell me you went into my room already! Without my permission? Just for the sake of Paris, I swear. And what does that look for? Nothing. Just promise you didn't go through my stuff. I promise. Ever since that day, I always wondered who she was talking about. The guy she likes really is a lucky one. I wish I hadn't known. Chat Noir, hey, are you listening? Huh? Sure you're alright? You haven't spoken for minutes. You should be here, not me. After all, you're the one who fought. Are you feverish or anything? Mm. I'm fine. Don't touch me. Hm. Mm. Listen. I know you are worried about me, but right now there are more important things to talk about. You're not safe anymore, nor is your family. You think I'm not aware of that? I am, and I know that I have to stop being Ladybug, but it hurts, okay? It hurts to know that someone else will be by your side. Someone else will give the miraculous to Rena and Carapass. And I will forget everything and everybody. I haven't thought about that. When you're not Ladybug anymore, you can't be the Guardian either. What means you're going to forget me? Would it be any different if I had killed him? What? No! You did the right thing! How can it be the right thing when I'm going to lose you? You'll never lose me, stupid kitty! Then, please, let me protect you! Huh? I mean, I understand that you can't be Ladybug anymore, but do you have to forget me? Nobody needs to know. Chad. Would you at least think about it? <laughs> Mary, please. It does not have to be forever. Just for now. Please. I am not ready to lose you. I know. I have agreed to let you protect me. But do you really have to be here every day? Oh, don't tell me you're getting tired of my company already. Silly kitty. Who could ever get tired of you? Hey, no reason to make fun of me. Just stop sh- I wasn't. But honestly, you've been here for two weeks already. Aren't your parents worried? Don't worry. They're not home. And besides, it's not like they would care anyway. <sighs> but hey! I am good. This way I can spend more time with you. Now you have to stop showing such a sad face. But chat, you know, I am returning to school tomorrow. You can't sneak around me all the time. Don't worry. I'll find a way to be by your side. Chat Noir, I'm serious. We can't afford to take risk. And my friends are very curious. If they see you around, they'll get suspicious. Hey, Mari. Can... can I ask you something? Sure, what is it? I'm pretty sh Um, it's about that guy. One you like. I can't tell you who it is. I know, but ever since I know your identity, I have wondered if I might know him. What? No! You sure? <laughs> yeah, I am pretty sure. So you don't know? I know! <laughs> Is that so? You know I've met your friends several times. Come on, you can tell me. I promise I won't tell anyone. Oh, you're probably talking about Nino. Um, no. But he's with Alia, you know her. Actually... She's my best friend and runs the lady blog. Marinette, listen. Huh? Sorry, but I was actually talking about the blonde guy you've been hanging around with all the time. Oh, you mean Adrian? Mm -hmm. Do you like him? I do, but more as a friend, I guess. Friend! Did not sleep at all. I wanna die. Oh, now you're overreacting. He's just a friend. That's so frustrating. I wish I didn't ask. Damn it, first day and I'm already late! <sighs> huh? Mature, why are you even hiding? It's not like she knows anything. That may be true, but if she finds out, she'll definitely stop being Ladybug. 
I won't risk that. Wasn't that... Girl, you're back, finally! Wah! Easy, tiger. You probably shouldn't jump on an injured person like that. I'm alright. I'm sorry, it's just... The past two weeks have been truly awful without her and Adrian. Yeah, you told me he couldn't come to school because of the fashion show. Even though I'm pretty sure I just saw him. Say, have you two been in touch since you left the hospital? No, he probably doesn't care. That's stupid. You didn't see him back then, Marinette. While you were in surgery, he cried his eyes out. What? He was so worried about you. Oh, come on, Hockey. I'm in the middle of something. Um, I should probably go inside. Because, you know, I'm injured. And, um, stuff. Yeah. Gosh, my excuses used to be better. But I really thought we'd have more time. Marinette, are you sure you can do this? What if you get hurt again? I am sorry, Tiki, but I have to do this. Tiki! Spots up! Ah! And he was like, huh? Hm, whatever.